Hey y'all, it's Mommy Wata and I'm back. Thank you so much for your support of My Right Botanicals. Please continue to like, share, comment, make sure you are subscribed and also please tap that bell notification button so you will be alerted whenever I post over here, okay? So let's see, Holy Spirit, what are we talking about at this time? Who do you wanna to use to plant a seed for Capricorn? Capricorn has hit the table, so let's see what messages are surrounding Capricorn energy, Holy Spirit. What is it that you would like for my Capricorn collective to know at this time? Please give me Holy Spirit insight and guidance. It could be about a Capricorn. It could be surrounding Capricorn energy, Holy Spirit. Y'all know how I go over here. So let's see what comes out. Let's see what comes out. Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Messages surrounding Capricorn energy from you through me at this time, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, what do we need to know at this time? So I regret everything I said about you. Forgive me, but it's in reverse. Somebody don't regret nothing they said about you, honey. Mm. What else, Holy Spirit? Somebody lying. Temperance Sagittarius, but it don't matter if they regret what if they don't regret it. People know they a liar, okay? Because the universe then came in and balanced this thing, and the proof is in the pudding. I'm hearing. So whoever is lying, they in this Capricorn karmic energy, and they're refusing to admit the truth. I'm hearing. They're refusing two, two, two to balance things the right way, even though balance is going to be restored regardless. But it's like the universe is trying to give them a shot to get some sort of relief, relief from how bad it can be. But they're still trying to hold on to what they said about somebody, even though it was a lie. OK. And they're going to end up not having any options. I'm telling you, it's like the universe is trying to go light on them, but they still lying. They refuse to admit that what they said about whoever was false. Okay. What else, Holy Spirit? They about to be out of options. Look, alone but not lonely, there's a difference. But this person seemingly don't care. If they lose, okay, whatever this is that they're about to lose, they don't care. And it looks like they're about to lose a partnership. They lied about the other woman. And now it's over between them and somebody else. But they don't care. They still not going to admit that they lied about this other woman. Okay. Anything else, Holy Spirit? God blocked it. Know that. So whatever this Capricorn energy was saying about the other woman to this possibly masculine in the middle of them, it was a lie. And he knows she lying. But she refused to tell the truth. She refused to admit that she was lying. And it has ended the connection between them. But it also has made it possible that this masculine can't go back to this other woman. But divine intervention is, is working here. I don't feel like this masculine was involved with this other woman while he was dealing with this Capricorn energy because of what this Capricorn lied and said, okay? And that he regretted now that he knows the truth. But whatever lie she said, it was major because it was something 
that could have resulted from these lies she told about this other woman that God had to block. So it was something major she lied about, which is also why she out of options. It's over for between her and this masculine for sure. But there's there's some other type of consequences and repercussions that she about to be facing if she don't admit the truth. That's also what I had picked up from the beginning. Let's do one more shuffle. So Holy Spirit, what do we need to know about this? What else rather do we need to know about this? From you through me at this time, Holy Spirit, what else do we need to know? Five of Cups, Two of Cups, Nine of Wands, Strength. When I tell you she holding on to that life for dear life, she holding on to that life for dear life. Okay, this person could be a Leo, but she definitely got some Capricorn energy prominent, prominent in her chart. It's like she is refusing to release this toxic, manipulative energy that she was in. Okay? You know, it's like whoever she was partnering with, he regret that he partnered with her. I'm telling you. And he's very disappointed in the outcome of this partnership but mostly we got crying over spilled milk vibe out here as well because whatever he whatever he did along with this leo energy against this other woman because it's given that that's why he he don't have the option of going back to her because he believed what this leo said now and they pursued these lies as fact against this other woman. Clarify, Holy Spirit. King of Swords. I'm telling you, they may have even tried to go to some sort of authorities on this woman. Temperance, Sagittarius energy. That's that divine intervention. This King of Swords is who this these people went to. Okay? No, this King of Swords is this masculine. This King of Wands is who these people went to. This King of Wands is the divine intervention here. Because these people went to some sort of authority figure. And really this, this King of Swords and this King of Wands are also the same energy too. But whoever... This masculine is that's between these two women. He cut. He and the king of swords to this other woman. Because I'm telling you, he went to a energy in an attempt to balance things in him and this Leo's favor now. Because of this lie she told on this other woman. And instead of being some sort of enforcer against this other woman, this king of wands has been some sort of saving grace. You know, he's established peace and balance on her behalf. She don't even know it. Ooh, and the Holy Spirit say that's the truth. He's been some sort of breakthrough for her. He's he's proved that whatever this Leo was saying was not true. Clarify, Holy Spirit, what I'm getting here, please and thank you. Put it out a little bit more for us. Seven of Cups, that's them lies. Five of Wands, that was going to cause drama for this other woman. Five of Swords, but that shit ain't working out like this, Leo thought, because you are innocent of whatever lies and charges she tried to put on you. You know, I'm hearing charges, okay? And I'm so glad that People are being vindicated. And again, this is for informational purposes only. This ain't for you to go trying to run to your local law enforcement office and say, oh, I heard a reading and they said that they was gone. They didn't went and try to put charges on me. So I'm trying to see if anybody made any reports and put any charges on me. Y'all, you know, people gonna have to grow the hell up for real with the bullshit and Get some called common sense for real. That's not what the purpose of this reading is for. 
The purpose of this reading is to let you know that it's good that you consider this man as a king of swords, 1010, that you have ended things with him because God is showing you why. Okay, this is hindsight. Okay, you're getting to see what has already transpired. You trying to go say something about that shit after it's already transpired, after it's already over. You making yourself look like these people you talking all that shit about. Okay? Five of Wands and Five of Swords energy. That's what it's giving. So please, y'all, don't be out here doing that bullshit. Because it don't make the person that you talking about look crazy. It make you look crazy. It's 2024. That shit don't work no more. Trying to go take a damn tarot video that ain't even mentioning your name or anything in relation to you at all. It can be easily proven that these people don't even know who the fuck you are. But you going and you taking a tarot video to an authority, King of Swords, King of Wands energy, trying to say some bullshit. This is 2024. These people didn't got hip to that because people didn't did it so much trying to get people in trouble. And that's not how this tarot thing work. That's not how this divine messaging thing work. That's why it's them backfired on them same people who done did that. Now, I'm picking up some shit like that. I'm picking up some shit like whoever this Leo energy is, she got some sort of service for you and tried to flip that shit and lie on you about something that you did or said. But it was proven that she was lying. Okay, God blocked that shit. I'm telling you, it's something about communication for me to even say all of that because people have been out here doing that shit these past couple of years for sure. But it's then got them fucked up in the long run because she fucked up right now. So if she took anything and caught 1212, which she did look like, and called it some sort of evidence against you to lie and say you did something 1221 that you didn't do. It's been proven that she lying and she in trouble for it. She in trouble for it now. Clarify, Holy Spirit. That's why she out of options. Tower, I'm telling you what I'm picking up on. Because see, that's why I'm saying what I'm saying right there. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for the clarification. Because see, she didn't did something like that against whoever this other woman is who ain't who energy ain't even really hit the table yet y'all because she's so far from uh, removed from this situation ain't nobody come fucking with her because she ain't did nothing that's what i be trying to tell folks you know you talking all that rah rah really listen to what's being said don't listen to respond listen to truly learn and gain wisdom and understanding overstand even because people be missing the message. They be missing the message. You don't need to go try to do nothing. Because you're going to be in the same category as this woman right here. Who in the tower right now for pulling that same shit. I'm telling y'all. Don't be out here doing that bullshit. Thinking you finna get somebody fucked up. Now nah, you fucking yourself up. Because people got enough knowledge and foresight. To be able to look at these readings and other things that people have tried to bring to them. They try to chop, chop and screw and finagle. People ain't slow. People know when something has been screen recorded and cut and chopped and screwed. They can tell how something is flowing. If somebody took different parts and spliced them together to try to make it seem like somebody said some shit. 1414. And this Leo did all of that. You better know it. She did all of that shit and getting fucked up now because she out of options. It's over. And she finna be alone, maybe in a jail cell. Ace of Pentacles. Because she felt like this was a prime opportunity to try to destroy you. Yeah, whatever. You know, I'm really picking up on some shit star. I'm really picking up on that. I'm really picking up on that she paid you for some sort of service. And that's what you do. You help people get in alignment. You help people heal and regenerate themselves. 
And she used that as an opportunity to try to lie on you and get you in trouble with an authority. But this authority got enough sense with this three of wands to see that, look, people investigate things. They're not just going to take your word for it, okay? If they take your word for it, they're not doing their job. They're not operating in this authoritative energy that they have vowed to uphold. And this person right here, they have vowed to uphold that. So he was going to investigate. So whoever this other woman is, because I don't know who the hell listening, but whoever this other woman is, okay, he went and saw and gained knowledge about her and saw that whatever this Leo acquired from her to try to lie on her about, this Leo paid for it. This Leo had to solicit this service. This Leo possibly has done this multiple times in an attempt to set this Ace of Pentacles star energy up. Now, this Ace of Pentacles could be this Capricorn energy that exists in whoever this other woman is as well. Okay? But he, he went and showed how this woman was continuing to return. And I didn't want to call this woman a Cancer Leo cusp, but that is what it's given. That's what it's given now. And he showed the judge, the authority over him, what his findings were, that this Leo chariot energy was coming towards this Ace of Pentacles star energy soliciting services, paying her for some sort of healing and renewal, faith and inspiration. That's what he didn't discover, child. Mm -mm. She about to be at the Ten of Wands. I just seen it on the bottom. Nine of Swords. That's about the same thing. Pretty damn close. Okay, they know the truth. It's over now. So all this trying to act like somebody was doing something against you and you know you done set up and chopped and screwed up some shit to lie on them with, that type of shit has played out. People ain't slow. And a lot of these people only entertain that because they were not aware of these spiritual divine energies who are able to offer this type of star service to others okay so this masculine you see we ain't even talked about him but the six of cups fell up under the king of swords because i'm telling you you don't connect with him anymore this is somebody from your past that you don't deal with anymore and he had a crazy ass energy he was attached to who decided that she was gonna come for you because you are special you are a star Okay, that's what this Ace of Pentacles um, star energy is giving. You a star. You you shine at what you do. So she couldn't help but get curious and see what it was about. And then she got envious and jealous with this Five of Wands, Five of Swords. Child. Son. That's her. And she been exposed. The truth has been illuminated about her child i would never i wouldn't even play myself like that i wouldn't even play myself like that and i'm telling you it's like nobody is standing in her corner including this king of swords energy that you have or whoever this other woman is rather has history with nobody is trying to offer her up any type of comfort or assistance or inspiration child because they know she lying and i'm telling you she still won't admit that she lying on this other woman any final messages holy spirit we have queen of cups queen of swords she still won't admit the truth but everybody know the truth. This King of Swords know the truth. This King of Wands know the truth. This Emperor know the truth. 
okay? All parties involved know the truth, except for the other woman, because she free and unencumbered of this bullshit. It ain't got nothing to do with her. God blocked it. Know that. That's the... That's one of the main points of this reading. And I'm dropping the mic after this. But when you when shit like this hit the table, that's God trying to tell you, don't worry about it, sweetheart. I done fixed it. I done took care of it. I'm just trying to let you know how I be looking out for you. So are you going to continue to send up praises in my name? Are you going to continue to operate and embrace the God within you. Because see, this is how I, how I huddle up and show out for you when you represent and rep me for real. And that's what God is saying. Informational purposes only to help strengthen your faith. Because he truly protects us from things seen and unseen. Okay? And I'm dropping the mic. I hope this message justice on the bottom. I'm trying to tell you. I'm dropping it, though. I hope this message helps someone. I hope it gave you insight and guidance on how you should move forward. But always remember, if it doesn't apply, please let it fly. Take only what resonates. Leave the rest. And I'll be back soon with another one, y'all. Peace.